seems like they're gathering around as they're sleeping. As they don't know that these baby velociraptors are eating. They all decide to sleep or just to stay by them to protect them in the night. They go away somewhere. They're all going to this area where the female velociraptor lays. And there's the male velociraptor. But if you look underneath the brush, it's an egg. They have an egg. It might hatch in a day or two. I don't know when day is, but an egg hatches, so we'll just go with it. So they both go to bed next to each other. And the other velociraptors just fall asleep somewhere. Meanwhile, these baby velociraptors decide to leave or just they decide to sleep next to it. They sleep next to each other. <clears throat> and they try to, what they decided to do was to get some plantation and cover the orange one up and try to keep it from being spotted by the other velociraptors. They're sleeping right now. You can kind of see the orange one, but the green one's pretty hard to see, but you can see the blue part. Let's go to the crocodile area. It looks like the crocodile got up after all the ants kind of calmed down. Starting to try to dig some more in this little area with this tail and try to make a better area for him to go in so I guess he's just gonna try to burrow like a turtle or like a tortoise and any other animal that burrows trying to clean out this area to burrow pretty cool starting to move some stuff to start to burrow maybe for an egg probably not because there's no other mate here no other thing Over thing there. But then there's something here. There's electronics. Which they don't know what that is because they're dinosaurs. But the system wonders what that is. But just keeps on burrowing. Trying to make his burrow go deeper. Meanwhile, back at the camp. raptors are sleeping. <clears throat> the baby ones, they still have no place to go except for down over at their base, little hideout. So they, pl they plan to stay here. And now that you look at this one a bit more, it kind of looks like that, that one's little brother. Or who lost baby. Now, continuing with the main narrator. Hello, I am back. I just had to go to the bathroom. So let's go over to the herbivore area. Where we last checked in at, something was weird. Something weird was in, this, in the tall grass. But they're all sleeping. Even though he looks awake, sometimes dinosaurs sleep standing up. So let's go down to the grass.
something's starting to dig something out here. Starting to dig a new territory. And to rip it out. After a little bit of digging, he's made a lot of progress digging. Still just getting some stuff out. Still digging his little campsite here. And keeping all of the stuff that he dug up for a blanket or something to sleep or make him warm in the night. So all he needs to do is find a stick and mark his territory. He's found a stick, he's gonna mark his territory. With that stick he's marking, he's marked his territory with that stick. It's, even though it's kind of hard to see, it still has a purpose to use. Then he, then he just heard a twig snap somewhere. Probably just another, because there is sticks at the bottom of this type of area, so probably was just that. Starting to dig a bit more. Here's something in the distance. Looks around. He looks around. He sees nothing. He looks the other way. He just sees herbivore. Decides to look behind him. Nothing. Nothing yet. Nothing. Might have been that twig that snapped. Considering he did sin. Let's just go over here and. Where's that? Through the grass, you see an Indoraptor. Looks like it's picking up sticks or making something out of them. The Scorpius Rex growls at it. The Indoraptor looks over at the Scorpius. Looks like he's getting in a position to fight. Like he did with the Indominus. He's biting grass and taking it. What is he doing? Or what is he doing? And it's kind of it's starting. It looks like it's burrowing into the grass. Burrowing, but then it's gone. Where'd it go? What's over there? What's over there? It's nowhere to be seen. Where did it go? Looks around, doesn't know where anything is. He heard a twig snap. Then he hears something behind him. Another twig snaps. And another. And another. It feels like the Indoraptor is behind him. Right as he turned around, he gets 